We have, I think, the lowest GPA in the O-line is a 3.5. We've got our center, Ryan Kohler, who actually missed the scrimmage last week because he was down in Annapolis. He's trying to get into the Naval, Naval Academy. We've got two guys that are actually Marine Magnet School students and both taking college level classes down there. Yeah, we consider ourselves the smartest part of the team. Got a lot of high SAT scores on that O-line. Together, they're a very smart crew, and they pick things up that other lines that I've had haven't picked up, and uh, I think that's their biggest asset right now. There are a lot of the values that help you in football, help you in school, and vice versa. All of us need to have really good memorization, and all of us need to know our rules to the point to where we can just do it without thinking about it. We just need to go up there and know what we're doing. Hmm. Well, I think it's definitely a work ethic. we got a lot of guys that want to work hard, go out there, and want to do their best for the team. Time management is the biggest key in that. There can't be procrastination, especially this year. A lot of us, or all of us in the O-line are taking AP classes. Me, myself, I'm taking four right now. So it's all about time management and how you manage your work in school. Say in study hall, you can't just goof around. Like You have to make sure you're doing all your work and getting everything done. We had a plan last year where we felt like, all right, as juniors, we're going to put them together for a year. Hopefully they grow. Uh, they learned the game more. They did that. And then they had a heck of an off-season in the, in the weight room. Uh, and so we're excited that they're back. You know, you take each one of them individually, there are no great players. But what we're hoping is the five of them together present a force that's going to help us in these ball games.